everybody welcome back to my channel um i am so happy to see all of my disney peaches today and it is a beautiful day here in south carolina it's the first of september and so um uh we've got fall right around the corner i'm so excited but today i am so happy uh to bring to you um uh, a box of goodies that i got from my friend Alex over at Crack and Trade. And so, y'all, hurry on back. I gotta show you this stuff. You're gonna love it. Okay, y'all, I want to start out um, showing you this box. I got a box full of goodies that I want to share with you. And um, you know that I'm a huge Loungefly fan. And it's not just bags. I love their pins as well. Um, <clears throat> when I first started out in Disney collecting and... and um, let me tell you, pins was the number one thing that I was after. That's all I collected. I did not collect plush. I did not collect backpacks, handbags, doonies, nothing. It was just pins. And so really and truly, that was my very first passion um, with Disney. And um, as far as, you know, collectibles go. And um, I just got, I just dove right in and got so excited about them. And so you can understand my excitement um, when I still have have such a passion for pins and pin collecting and I do some pin trading also I don't do pin trading as much as I do collect but um so I'm so excited to bring you this video today um uh, my friend Alex over at crack and trade um sent me a little box of goodies to share with you guys and I just cannot wait to do so um this box has some of my favorite things in them um let me show you one of the first things okay so you remember that my favorite color is pink right <laughs> yes i love it and y'all i could not be more excited to unbox this with you um it is the new oh and look this very um it's a net tight bag. I wouldn't really, I, it, I guess it is a dust bag, but um, it doesn't have a closure to it or anything, but it is awesome to keep your bag in um, if you're not using it so that it stays free of dust and uh, a lot of the sun damage and stuff that can happen. But y'all, oh my gosh, look how beautiful. Let me bring it up close and see if you can see the, the Crack and Trade uh, logo here on the back. You see that? Isn't it beautiful? Oh my goodness. Y'all, this is the clamshell. Now, I have the first original clamshell, and I love it, and I'll show you that too. But here is the newer one. Look at all the beautiful silver hardware. That is just beautiful. The clips, the, the rings on the back for your straps. This could be made into a backpack, hence the four loops, or you can just wear it, um, carry it like this. Um, I really like the backpack version because um, if you're in the park and you're wanting to go around, y'all, this is so functional. You can use this for a backpack for storage. You can use it to display your pens. You can use it. It's very multifunctional, and you will see that as we go along in this unboxing. But I love this pink. It's beautiful. Okay, so let me show you real quick. I'm going to show you this one, and which this little this little jewel is new to the bag. Look at my first one, and it was the black one, and it has a strap that I used up at the top, and you can do the same. I, I didn't finish telling you. You can use this as a backpack 
you see the loops or you can put the straps over um, each of these and it goes over the top and you can put it on your sh shoulder you can wear it as a backpack um, it's multifunctional I'm telling you but this was the first one that um, I got from crack and trade and I love it uh, it's in black which I think is hugely popular um, because the guys will really like the black now um, this one also comes in a beautiful seafoam green and so I think that's beautiful too but I love this but this was the original one I have my hocus pocus pens uh, in here right now you can use these just as a pen bag or you can use this to carry to the park um, and do it either way you want to it's your bag so use it the way you want to but the, what I love about this is that this did not have it just has your uh, notice the rings look how much larger the rings are on this one than the first one you see them there Oh, wow. What a comparison. And I, it still has the same beautiful hardware um, as before. And I'm sure the strap is inside the bag. So we'll look at that in a minute. But it still has the same three compartments um, as this one does. Um, really, I feel like it's, it's really just like this one except there's a few uh, different things that they've changed, which I think would be a great in improvement. The the rings for your strap are larger, and they've added this awesome hanger or holder on on the top. It's uh it's made out of a similar material um, as as the bag, and uh, where this one didn't have that, now you have this in case you just want to hold it in your hand. Um, I think that's a great addition to this bag so I just wanted to show you a comparison that here's the first one and then of course the new one and so let's look at this so first of all you have this awesome first uh, compartment that is see-through and when you open it you have their famous foam board that the pins just stick so good to this um it's really hard to shake them off and let me get my other bag and i'll show you my black one compared to this one okay hold on one second okay so here is the first one um the board that was in there and here is the new pink one and you can see i mean i don't even have this board full and not only can you put pins on the front but you can also put pins on the back so you have tons of space and there's another compartment that you could actually put another board in um instead of just throwing extra goodies in it you could put another uh board in there and you can have two of these um which is perfect for a collection and i love this you know i don't have a very large hocus pocus collection but i love what i have and i'm hoping to grow it um as the future goes and um and it, this fits on there so nicely i just love how it it really looks great in it um the circular form of the board just really gives you so many options uh, to display your pens and groups or just put them all together however you would like to do it but yeah this is what it looks like what this looks like with pens on it so i think it looks great and it looks so good in the window let me show you that so here is uh, like i showed you before this is what it looks like in the window i'm trying not to get the uh studio lighting on uh the plastic but um it displays so beautifully um through the see-through window of your bag and so if you're carrying on a, your backpack if you're carrying your backpack on your back that's what people see so it's just a beautiful i just love that um i haven't had the opportunity i haven't been back to the park yet since i've had this so i haven't had the opportunity to carry it yet but i'm really looking forward um to doing that so again you have this foam board which you can put pins on the front and the back that goes in to your uh see-through front pouch and then it just zips over and you have such beautiful 
uh, display in your bag. Now, the middle section, which is right here, when you unzip it, this is your main compartment. And when you open it up, look how spacious that is. Here is our straps. Oh, wow, well, look. You have individual straps that hook to each one. And like I said, you can just take one and put it across the top. And it has stuffing inside. Let's take that out. Wow, y'all, look how huge this is inside. You could put, you could even put a water bottle in there if you wanted to. There's place for your wallet, your keys, your camera. I could put tons of stuff. Now you couldn't put a DSLR in there, but you could put a point and shoot or your phone or whatever. It fits a lot of stuff in there. And these, uh, these, the up in here feels kind of padded. So I'm sure whatever you put in there will be greatly protected uh, when you're using it. And so, yeah, that, that particular compartment is perfect it's perfect then you have an additional pocket or the compartment i should say in the back and there is another board that you have to put more pins on now if you want to put more pins on it you can if you want to leave that out because maybe you got a smaller collection in your bag um you can use this pocket um look how big this pocket is oh my gosh and it has an interior slip pocket on top of that and might i add it's a beautiful shade of pink i love that so you could use this to either put more pins on your board and put it in there and zip it up and then you have two boards full of pins or you can just put um you know some things that i have put in there are backer cards like every pin that i have um hocus pocus pen that i have in my black bag i have the backer card if it came with a backer card in my compartment right there because i'm not ready to use more pens back there yet because i don't have enough of that particular collection so um i have backer cards in here and i have some other little things that i keep in there that is helpful when i'm doing like pen trading or um things that i need i might want to i keep a little rag in there that i can dust my pins off or dust the bag off if I need to and um you can do anything with that compartment so I love it and again I love the new little strap here that you can hang it on a hook you can hold on to it with your hand it is just perfect now not if that wasn't enough storage for your cracking uh, bag look at this you have another yet another zipper pocket on the very back and y'all it is spacious look at that that's how big that is and y'all let me tell you you could put this could be your hideaway pocket especially if you use this as a backpack you will have this part on your back so this would be a great place to put cash or some personal cards things like that so that they're not open um to the back to the public so this is what the public will be seeing this will be what is against your back so i really feel like that would be awesome um to put um things you kind of want to stay close to you you know so i love y'all i love these new designs of these um places for your strap oh wow that just looks awesome so y'all this is the new clamshell you have the pink you have the seafoam green and i think you still can get the uh, black although the black may be on pre-order because it, it is a bit more popular and also with that you can still order individual pieces like this just the foam itself um if you need extra pieces to insert into your bags um they also have um extras that goes like into the meg or into um all the other um books that you have 
you know they have the places that you clip them in a book all of this is on their website and um, they have got plenty of this kind of stuff for you if you already have some books and you just need some extra pieces some extra pages um, yeah definitely hit them up for the extra foam boards yeah. Kraken has all of these pieces that you need at their website. I will be putting down below my special link uh, to Kraken Trade and um, all of the uh, website link um, if you just want to go look. I'll also put, uh, I'll try to put some prices and some things. Um, I know, I believe the clamshell is 45 unless I'm um, mistaken. And um, the other bags, the prices, I'll try to link some of that down below also. Um, if I don't put the prices, I'll put the link to the page that'll take you straight to the product, okay? And uh, yeah, these things are awesome. Let me show you another board that I got from a uh, crack and trade that if you want it to like if you're a vlogger and you do videos or anything like that or if you just want it to display on because I think it's a great idea to display pins on them let me show you something else I got okay so y'all I got this from crack and trade also and look how large this is it's one of their larger boards and y'all I just wanted something like like this there's no holes to put it in a book it is just really for display and I know there's a lot of people that do pen sales or they like to show their pens when they're doing a video this is perfect for that and for me um, I'm using it for I have a very small special collection that I've started and it is the um, Ariel and Eric in the boat kind of like the kissing scene and so i have started i have a few pins that are nothing but ariel and eric in the boat and this is called kiss the girl and it's a profile of them in the boat these boards is look how thick they are i can put pins on the front and I can have pens on the side. And I just have this kind of sitting on a, a table propped up against the wall. And I just think it's so pretty. This black is beautiful. Um, I love that deep black color and any any pen you put on this is going to pop right off of it. And there's a lot of light shining on it right now because of my lighting. But it really is beautiful. And it's a real deep color. And he has these in other colors as well. So, uh, yeah, I love the display boards also. So, if you do videos or if you like to display pens on something different, check out one of these boards also. Now, I want to show you something else that you can get at Crack and Trade, and I love this. I'm actually going to get me a, a bunch of these, um, as long as they're available. Um, I've got from Crack and Trade, um, and you can see, I think they've done some update to this. They've got their logo now uh, where it's not quite so obvious, and it's just kind of uh, embossed in there. But... Um, it says cracking right here, but y'all look at this pen page. It's got four. This is your larger for larger pens. Um, it's got four different pockets on this particular one. Y'all, what I love about it, let me bring it up close so you can see it, okay? Y'all, what I love about this is that you have a snap here, and this is a real thick material that is going to house your beautiful larger pens on their backer cards. If you're like me, I love when I can to keep my pens on their backer cards, and it just preserves them, and if you're going to trade or sell your pens at any time in the future, this would be perfect to have and to just store for your collection. So this pops up. It's just a snap. And then your pen just comes out and in of the pocket. Look at there. Are you kidding me? That is the greatest idea ever. When I saw these, I flipped out. I called Mitzi and I was like, you're not going to believe what they've got. And it just goes right back in the pocket and you snap it back to. It stays free of dust and dirt and anything that can damage your pens. 
Oh my goodness. So this is the larger size and um, I'll put down below the dimensions of these. And then they also have the smaller size. This is your typical baseball card, baseball card sleeve that you would get at Hobby Lobby, Walmart, Target, all of those places. But it has the snap closure and it's a pocket. Your pens don't fall out. How many, raise your little hand, if you ever get your book out to look at your pens and they fall out because you didn't pin them into the page. And then when you pin them into the page, it ruins that particular page. So I love this for that reason. You've got the snap closure just like you did with the bigger one and your pen comes out. This is the size, just a normal, uh, uh, you know what a normal open edition a lot of limited edition pen sizes are and it fits perfectly in your little pocket and when you put your pen in which it goes in perfectly um you put your pen in and if i can get do it with this without a table in front of me um there you go you got your pen in it snapped and I love these are reinforced right here. Let me bring it up so you can see it closer. And I love this that it has this reinforcement of each hole like that so they don't tear out of your book. I mean, that is just perfect. These are your silver metal snap closures. It's absolutely perfect. And you get this particular one has three in a row so you have a total of nine just like you do with baseball card sleeves so y'all that is perfect i'm going to put all the information about these down below in the description but be sure to check that out you will love these okay y'all i want to show you one more group of things and you're going to flip these are absolutely gorgeous so my favorite thing is pens and so um y'all i'm looking at their website just to make sure i get this right this beauty is from lounge fly let me take it out of the bag because the bag is not going to do it justice we got to take it out of the bag so you can actually see the beauty of this pen oh my goodness okay y'all this pen, so it is Mulan and Mushu. Isn't this absolutely stunning? So gorgeous. Look at the detail. I would call this a mini jumbo. It's really, really large and compared to other pens. And it is stunning, y'all. This is Disney Loungefly. It's limited edition 600 yes and it's $24.99 you can get this on their website oh wow the back is beautiful it's got the Disney logo I hope you'll be able to see it it's got the Disney logo and it's got the crown from Loungefly and this is stunning look at that and it has the limited edition on the back and it's LE 600. Y'all, so beautiful. So it comes on the back. On the back, it comes with the butterfly uh, back post covers. And y'all, this is beautiful. Okay, so that's Mulan. She's beautiful. The next one that I want to show you, I think a lot of people are going to fall in love with, and you'll have to go over and get it from um, Crack and Trade. It's Loungefly also, but it's Loungefly Villain. And y'all, this pen is just as beautiful. It is Scar. Look at that. Is that not stunning? Absolutely stunning. I cannot wait to put this in my Villains. I collect Villains. I collect all villains and I cannot wait to get this in my villains collection. So, so beautiful. It's LE 600 also. It has the same butterfly pen post covers. And y'all, let's look at the back of this one. This one is $24.99 also. It's so beautiful. Oh, yes. It has the limited edition on the back. And it has the Disney logo and it has the crown from Funko and Loungefly. Oh, I love it. 
so beautiful. That is the prettiest scar pen I think I've ever seen. Again, look how beautiful scar is. I mean, seriously. Wow. He is stunning. That is a beautiful, beautiful job. Okay, let me show you a beautiful princess. Y'all, I just love this too. Oh my goodness. This is Miss Ariel. Look how beautiful she is. Oh wow. If you could only see this in person, you would just love it. And this is limited edition 600 also. This one is only $15.99. Now, let me show you the difference. Look at the, look at the size comparison with Mulan and Ariel. Look how beautiful. But you can see how big Mulan is compared to Ariel. So, they're both LE 600. And this is absolutely stunning of Ariel uh, with her tail. And she has, looks like a seashell. It says, it's called Ariel's Adventures. And it's Ariel Seashell Pen. That's the name of it. Because she's got an, a seashell up to her ear. You see there, isn't that beautiful? Let's turn around and look at the back. So here's the back of Ariel. Such a pretty bag. I love it. So, oh, I love these. And these pens are exclusive to Crack and Trade. Did I tell you that? Um, these are their exclusive pens. So, um, this is just even more fabulous. Okay, I got one more to show you. And you're going to love this one, too. I think this is beautiful. Y'all, this one is called um, Ariel's Adventures. And this is Ariel and Flounder Series 2. It's a limited edition of 600 and it's $15.99. Also, look at that. Isn't that just beautiful? Love her hair. And Flounder up in her arms. Her tail's coming up. Just so beautiful. Wow. Let me show you both of these together. The Seashell and Friends. Oh, wow. I just love Ariel's hair on this one. So pretty. So, these are $15.99 each, and they're both LE600. So, y'all, you've got to go check Crack and, Crack and Trade out. They have, y'all, I'm not kidding you. They have got the most beautiful pen. Y'all, you have to go check Crack and Trade out. They have got some of the most beautiful pens. And y'all, they've got mystery, every mystery box you can think of. They've got pre-order stuff that hasn't even come out. They've got Hocus Pocus mystery pens. Uh, the boxes uh, for pre-order, those are on their website. They've got exclusives just like this. They have got fig pen. Some beautiful fig pens. Uh, there's one of Wally that Mitzi will flip over when I tell her about it. They are just beautiful. So Crack and Trade is just getting the most beautiful pens. They have they have tons of stock, and they have plus pre-orders. So y'all, if you're looking for your pens, go check them out. They're really just willing to help you in any way they can. So. Thank you so much, Alex, for sending these my way, and I just love everything. Y'all, again, if you are looking for a new bag to carry to the parks, if you want one that um, you just want to put some pins in, you've got two sections to put pin boards in this one. Y'all, I'm telling you, you will love it. And, I mean, if you need the extra boards also, they really do have anything that you need um, for your pen collections, your your uh, trading, your, your hobby. Um, I tell you, pens, Disney pens are more than just a hobby to me. They're just like a passion. So, um, I'm telling you what. I love it so much, but you will not be disappointed if you go check those guys out. And also, be sure to click on my link below, and um, uh, you can access their website through that. And um, I'll be putting a lot of information down below, so be sure to check down there. And so, 
I just wanted to share it with you. I'm so excited about pens. I'm so excited about pen storage. I always need pen books. I always, because I'm constantly buying pens. So, um, but anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and being here. Um, don't forget to keep checking back. We got a lot of fun stuff coming up. So, thank you. We'll see you the next time. Bye.